you clicked on this video, then you already know what we're doing here. Welcome back to my channel. If you haven't already, give this video a big thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button for me. Okay, this one is a big one. Biggest questions I get asked all the time. It is some valuable information for you and I, especially creators on the platform here on YouTube. I'm so excited to share it with you because I know it's very hard to make money these days. Let's get started. How to make money on YouTube, okay, with out reaching monetization. Now we all know in order to monetize your channel and for AdSense to kick in, you have to have like 4,000 hours watched and a thousand subscribers. If you're just starting off, well, these are some things I wish I knew before I started my YouTube channel because there's so many options to make money on YouTube without having monetization tools on the platform. Here we go. First and foremost, when you make a video on YouTube, let's say 10 people watch it. That's 10 people that you can put something in front of that they might be interested in, they might buy. Think about that. 10 people you've gotten 10 people's attention what you could do with 10 people's attention when you make a video call to action if you do not have like a merch or a product get one create an item that people can buy related around your content there are so many options to make online stores for free at no cost no inventory that's just sitting there waiting to be sold none of that okay your logo your message on products and you can design it yourself and you can Share this store with your fans. You do not need to have a certain criteria in order to share this link. You can put it in the description box and tell people, call to action. Hey guys, go shop my merch, jessicashade.com slash shop. That is the very first thing you can do. People love your videos. They love you. They love watching you. They feel connected to your messages. They want to be involved. They want to support. They're going to buy your merch, buy your product, especially if you have a good product. There's so many YouTubers who have food products. Pizza in a bottle. Thought, why not add everything I love about pizza into a bottle so I can make anything taste like pizza? Pizza Fi is the ultimate condiment to add a pizza zest to literally any meal. Chocolate bars, rose petals, all of these items fit into their brand. So find something that fits into your brand. Affiliate links. So let's say you're creating a video, you are using TubeBuddy, certain apps, certain other platforms. When you refer someone, you get paid. Definitely go onto these platforms, of extension plugins. I don't know how how many platforms out there have affiliate links but many of them do add them in the description and you let your fans know hey guys go over to current and sign up go over to TubeBuddy and sign up use my link to sign up when people use your link to sign up affiliated links they earn you money not a lot but hey money is money five dollars adds up every couple people who knows how much money you could make Affiliate links. Add all of your affiliate links in the description below. Drive your audience to a subscription-based platform. Now, if you don't have the opportunity to do that with YouTube, a subscription-based, there's so many opportunities for platforms where you can sell your training sessions, you can sell your knowledge, you can sell your videos. If you have tutorials, whatever it is, a subscription-based so somebody can come over and they can buy service that you have to offer. Whatever it is, whether it's teaching yoga, it could be fitness, it could be health videos, it could be beauty tutorials whatever it is so many youtubers these days have created items that you and I can use clothing right we want something that entices not only just what we see what we see but what we can taste what we can smell what we can inhale what we can feel if you have a product brand it market it and advertise it in your videos so people can buy it motivate your fans to leave you tips on payment platforms when you're creating and you're talking to your fans and your fans are here and they're listening ask for donations talk to them ask them to go on over Venmo, your Zelle, your Cash App, PayPal, and send some money. Donate. People are always willing to send a couple bucks, especially if you have goals and a desire. I promise you there's so many people out there that are probably watching your content. They see your passion and they want to invest in you. Now, $5 is $5, like I said. So if they send you $5 tip for your content, your motivational word, so share your links. Tell your fans, go leave me some tips if you're creating content for your audience and an audience requests something and you filled their request, have them tip you. You can sell your videos. I have people all the time who email me and ask me to pay me to make reaction videos for their content. So this is something you can do too. Whatever it is that you are wrapping your videos around, whether it's beauty and you fulfill it, ask them to leave you a tip and chances are they just might. Every creator on YouTube is given a CPM. A CPM is cost per milli. So you can charge people a cost per thousand views. Now, analytics already does this for you on YouTube. So mine is about $5 and a few 
you send. Everyone's is different depending on audience retention, but we can get into that another time. You can charge people per thousand views, $5, $10, whatever you think your content is worth, but make it reasonable. Like I said, analytics on YouTube allows this to already be mapped out for you. Simple as that, you never know. I know creators like Mr. Beast and so many other creators that go online to streaming platforms, go into creators' lives and leave them surprise amounts of tips. So asking for tips is not wrong at all, especially if you're a creator and you're providing a service for free. Leave me tips for bringing you guys this video, how to make your own money on social media. There's so many other options. I don't know if you guys are familiar with Fiverr. Fiverr is a platform in which you can go on and you can create whatever you create, whether it's thumbnails, animations, you could record sounds, DJing, mixing, producing in any way. Fiverr gives you the platform to be able to sell your art. So as an artist and a creator like you and I, if you haven't heard of Fiverr, definitely jump on it. This is a platform where you can make money as a creator, okay? So there's another way to make money on social media that I didn't mention in this video, and that is Instagram Reels. If you haven't linked your Instagram to your Facebook yet, I would suggest doing so because this will allow Facebook to pay you for your Instagram Reels. It's called the Reels Play Bonus Program, which pays a bonus to anyone who's Reels at least 1,000 views over a 30-day period. And some creators can make up to $35,000 per month. Ask for sponsorships. Reach out to your favorite boutique brands or even your biggest brands, and you never know, you might get a response. They will always be on the lookout. Their marketing teams are always hiring influencers, work with and collab with, and you just might get sponsorships. Anyways, that's all I have for you guys today. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button and leave me comments below. Let me know if this was helpful. If I left anything out, if you have anything to tell me, I usually respond to the comments. I give one shout out on every video. So if you want a shout out, leave me a comment. I love you guys. See you guys in the next video.